something egg-siding is happening. I ordered 18 quail eggs from eBay and I'll be hatching them for the first time. For the first 24 hours, they need to rest after being shooken up in shipping, so I won't be putting them in the incubator until the next day. Alright, so it's been 24 hours and I'm putting all the quail eggs into the incubator, just making sure I have enough space for all 18 of them to fit. This is day two and I decided to do the first candling. This egg is not fertilized. As you can see, the light shines straight through it. And I'm going to candle another one. This one is fertilized because it's dark and the light does not shine through it. Now this next one has a crack in it and I don't think it's fertilized anyway. So this one I had to get rid of. So setting the incubator was not hard, but all of the other videos that I've watched about hatching eggs, whether it be quail or chicken, said that incubators lie, and that is true. The temperature um, did not match what I set the incubator to, so I had to kind of adjust it to make sure that it was regulated. And here we are at the first hatch, which I almost missed. I just happened to come over and check, and it was coming out, so I grabbed the phone and recorded immediately and this little guy was popping out hopping all over the place <laughs> and i was i was excited and so were the kids So I stayed up until about 1 a.m. and by then three of them hatched and by the morning time there were five of them. And here's one in the back hatching now, the darker one. And it looks like the one next to it is trying to help. <laughs> and there he goes. And here's another one right in front popping out. It didn't take too long for this one to pop out. Some of them did take a little while to break out of the shell, but this one popped right out very quickly. So at this point, there were about nine or ten of them, and I took about eight of them to the brooder slash hutch because they were trampling all over the ones that were trying to come out of the egg. All right, guys, I'll update you in another video to let you know how they are doing. Thank you for watching. See you next time.